that she has been making for years and I finally decided to get the ingredients to try it. Obviously, onion, green pepper, scrambled sausage, pork sausage, uh, scrambled beef, and I chopped, we had some smoke links on the grill the other night. So I've chopped some of those up in there. And then after that, we're going to add some chicken flavored rice. And the dirty rice and I'm looking for I think some tomatoes I'm gonna check my cabinet my pantry and see if I've got some tomatoes I do not have the tropical sazon but I do have the other sazon and I have complete season so once again an inspiration for a recipe based on what I have so I do have stewed tomatoes, so I'm going to chop a few of those up, and then we're going to get the complete seasoning and the sazon, and I'm going to put my fresh garlic in there. I almost forgot. That's going in that pot. They're going in that pot. This smells so good, y'all. <music> Get a little fried up, kind of like the uh, rice and rice, and then that takes two cups of water. The dirty rice takes two and a half cups of water, and then we're gonna be popping. way smaller than hers and I did do a less amount of meat so I'm doing three cups of water for now and I'm bringing it to a boil I, I don't want it to be too watery so I'm kind of waiting to see so I'm just gonna just gonna let that get to a boil and I haven't added the complete seasoning or the sauce yet I'm gonna taste it make sure it's not too it's already salty because the rice is have their own seasoning so we're gonna wait and see tasting it yeah it does meet the seasoning <laughs> after adding that water it's a little bit watered down and we're just gonna I guess that's like about a teaspoon two teaspoons I'm gonna stir that in now Get me a lid. Let this boil, then simmer like the direction said. I went ahead and poured the other half of that cup in there, and it's getting to its boil. So, as soon as it gets to boiling on the other side of this pot, I'm gonna put the lid on. Big hungry to come out, obviously. <laughs> Fortnite break. He hungry, so he eating seafood salad because this ain't ready yet. <laughs> My little cat friend came back, so we gave him some cat food. He's sneaky. He knows. He, he waits for the door to open. He tries to use his paw to show us how to open the door, and he tried to get in before, <laughs> and he keep coming back. Unless he's eating from the dumpster, which we've seen him do. So he decides to eat at our restaurant whenever he wants to. And he will stand out here and beg. He will roll around until we open the door and give him something. We think he used to be one of the baby cats from the mother and her little kittens that used to be around here. But who knows? He acts like everybody's feeding him. And my kid wanted to eat with him. <laughs> he coming. Right where he was hey. standing at the whole hey. time. Nah, just let Get him your see. little arms away. Just let him do it.
My phone about to die. So there you go, guys. Risa Richardson House Rice. Go to her channel. Check out her recipes. She's going to get you fed right. There's another inspiration. Everything's going to be linked down in the comments. Videos and all. Later, gypsies. Bye.